Hello dear learners, I am Dr. Pallavi Gugoy of Krishnakanta Handik State Open University. Welcome to today's program. This is the second video of Unit 6, Vocabulary, Phrasal Verbs, Words Used as Different Classes. This is from the course Foundation Course in English, Semester 1, Block 1. So let us quickly begin. Starting with the learning objectives, after going through this video, the learner will be able to define the term phrasal verb, give suitable examples of phrasal verbs, and provide examples of words used as different classes. Phrasal verbs. A verb can combine with an adverb or a preposition. When it combines with an adverb, it is called a phrasal verb. Example, breakout. War broke out between the two countries. Here is a list of phrasal verbs given with illustrative examples. Let's look at the phrasal verb bring up. Oliver was brought up in a poor house. So does that make sense? Let's take another one. Call on. I called on the minister in the circuit house. Call in. Please call in a doctor immediately. Fall out. The brothers have fallen out after their father's death. Give up. Gandhi gave up his attempt to become an English gentleman. Go out. The light has gone out. Get along. She couldn't get along with her mother-in-law. Look into. The officer looked into the matter. Look for. He looked for the pen in the cupboard. A few more examples of phrasal verbs are as mentioned below. Catch up. Close down. Come across. Come off. Come about. Come off. Fall back. Fall on. Fall through. Go down. Go into. Hold on. Hold up. Keep off. Keep on. Keep up. Lay out. Live on. Pass away. Pass for. Pass off. Put down. Put off. Put in. Put out. Put up with. Run after. Run up. See through. See off. So there are countless phrasal verbs as you can see that we use in our day-to-day -day language. Now let's look at words used as different classes. Here is the chart. Starting with nouns. Let us take the noun ability. When it takes the adjective form, it becomes able. And when it takes the form of verb, enable. Similarly, activity. The adjective form would be active and the verb form would be activate. Let's take another example, advice. The adjective would be advocate and the verb form would be advice with an S. Okay, the noun form is with advice with C and the verb form would be advice with an S. So this brings us to the end of the video. Here are a few questions to check your progress. Question number one, what is phrasal verb? Question number two, make sentences with the given phrasal verbs. A, bring up. B, look after. C, get along. D. Look for. Question number 3. Give any three examples of words used as different classes. Here is the reference. I hope you would go through the BA English graduate self-learning material that is the SLM. Thank you dear learner.